Using trending sounds is still one of the fastest ways to grow on TikTok, and you can turn your account into an automated sales machine when you combine these types of videos with the one to three minute talking educational videos that TikTok's prioritizing right now. Now, most people teach you to search keywords related to your niche, and then you're gonna filter it by most liked in the last 30 days, but I found that that doesn't actually give you the most relevant content for your niche. And so I'm gonna show you three better ways to find trending sounds that you can use to go viral and grow your following. All right, so we're gonna go here to my phone and I'm gonna show you one of the easiest ways to find trending sounds on TikTok, which is actually go into your For You page and clicking search. And all you need to do is type in trending sounds or viral sounds, and it's gonna pull up something that looks like this. Um, you're gonna see the trending sounds and you're gonna be able to click see more. Now from here, you're gonna be able to see a bunch of stuff, kind of like ratings of the top 10 to 12 songs right now. And what you wanna do is look for ones that only have 100,000 to 300,000 videos. And the reason for this is because we want you to find ones that aren't overly saturated so you have a greater chance of going viral. So as an example, I'm just going to click this one of uh, Montel Jordan. This is how we do it because when you come to this page, when you click on the song, you're actually going to be able to see what other people have posted. And when you click on each one, you're going to be able to see how many likes and comments and shares, and you can see these videos all going viral, but it's going to help you to get ideas for what you should be posting. Now, another way to do this is you can actually go back to your For You page and you can click like you're gonna add a video and click add sound at the top. And then from here, you can scroll down to these playlists and you can already see TikTok viral. And if you go into that, you're also gonna be able to see recommended and featured. And these are gonna be other places that you're gonna be able to look for these viral sounds. And the same thing, you can click on them and you can see what kind of content is being created. Now, this is by far the easiest method to find those trending sounds, but you're gonna miss out on those early trends that are gonna allow you to get those massive numbers and really go viral and grow your following. So I wanna introduce you to method number two. There are actually these TikTok creators that all they do is seek out the early viral trends and they share these trending sounds on their profile three or more times per day. And so I'm gonna recommend that you find two or three of these creators that way you always have easy trend ideas delivered right to your For You page. Now, they don't have to be in your niche. And honestly, you don't have to follow them either. You just wanna know who they are, maybe save one of their videos. So you can go check out their profile and look through the trending sounds and find ones that you think are gonna be a good fit for your account. All right, so let's go back to the phone. I'm gonna show you how to find these accounts. And we're gonna to go to our For You page, back to the search bar. And this time we're gonna type in trend alerts. And then once you do this, you're gonna go back to your filter and you're gonna to wanna to set it to this month because you wanna make sure that you're getting recent trends that are actually still trending, not too old, all right? Now from here, you're gonna find different creators. Uh, here's one of them. We can scroll through this. There might be a couple that I recognize. Uh, she does this as well. She does this. So you're gonna be able to find a couple of of these, you're going to follow them or just save their videos. Now, when they post the trending sounds like this, they're usually going to have information on the screen that tells you how to use the sound because usually there's a certain way it's being used. You can also go click on the sound and look at the videos that are being created from the original down to all of the ones that are going viral after and see what people are doing. But these creators do a good job of showing you how to use the sound to increase your chances of going viral. But since these trends are not niche specific and may not be relevant to your account, I have one more strategy that I wanna to show to you. And this is actually how I get 90% of my trending content ideas and where I find most of my trending sounds. By far, the best way to find trending sounds and content is to optimize your For You page. That way you get a constant stream of niche content delivered to you every single day. Optimizing your For You page is also an important step for going viral and getting big views with your content because it allows the TikTok algorithm to categorize you so that way they can show your content to the right people and then you're gonna get more watch time and more views. I explain exactly how to optimize your account and your For You page in this video. So I'll go ahead and leave that in the description so you can take a look at it if you want a deeper dive when this video is over. But I do wanna give you a quick summary so you can start using this strategy yourself. So the first thing is that you want to go and optimize your account by following 10 to 15 other creators that are in your niche creating content similar to what you want to create. Once you've found and followed those creators, I just want you to go over to your following page and start engaging with all of this content. Like it, leave comments if you have something to add to the conversation, but most importantly, just watch the content. And the goal here is to just show the algorithm what you're interested in. And once you do that for about five to 10 minutes, when you go back to your For You page, you're gonna start seeing all of that niche content. 
Now, if you're not seeing exclusively the type of content that you want to be seeing in your For You page, just do it again. This process happens really fast, so it shouldn't take you too many times of engaging with your follower content to start getting new stuff delivered to your For You page. So now what you're going to do is a couple of times a day, it can just be while you're sitting on the couch, you know, vegging out in front of a show, you're just going to scroll through your For You page and you're really going to be looking for content that's going to have a ton of likes. Eventually, when you find a video, what you're going to want to do is click on that person's name and then you're going to be able to click just watch and it's going to take you down there and you're going to be able to see how many views that video has. So this video has 110,000 views, which is good. Generally, I'm going to recommend that you're looking for videos that have at least 30 to 50,000 views. But most importantly, you want to figure out like, is it an outlier for that particular creator? So if they're regularly getting 20,000 views, then 30,000 isn't really an outlier. You're looking for 100,000 or more. But if they're a creator that's usually getting between 500 and 2,000 views and suddenly they're getting 30,000 views, that means there's a lot of viral potential on that piece of content. Once your For You page is set up, this is the easiest and most effective way to find the content that's going viral in your niche. So that way you can jump on those trends and create your own versions of this content to grow your following as quickly as possible. And while you're going through this process and you're scrolling through that feed, just make sure that you're keeping a lookout for other creators that you can add and start following. That way you can get better and better recommendations. Now, if you've made it this far, I've got two I bonus tips for you that are going to take this to the I next level. Way. The first bonus tip is that over time, as you're scrolling your For You page, you're going to start noticing that certain creators tend to go viral a lot. And you want to make special note of these creators. And if you can find three to five of them that you can go and click on your phone, check, click to their profile and look at their recent videos to find those big viral outlier videos that they're doing, you're going to have plenty of ideas and they're going to do a lot of the heavy lifting and the work for you, especially if they're posting the text-based video content that's very short. If they're going viral consistently posting that kind of content, they're using these same strategies and they're finding the viral sounds and the viral formats for you. My second tip is something that I think a lot of the TikTok gurus are probably doing, but they're not telling anyone, which is you create multiple accounts across different niches and optimize those for you pages. And the same thing, you get those creators that you can go look at. Because if you are keeping a finger on the pulse of what is trending across different niches, you can find something that's going viral in one niche, but not in yours. And you can bring it over to your space and get that first big viral video using that format. For example, I have an account where I follow nothing but online fitness coaches and their content to see what's trending because fitness and online business have a lot of similarities. And I always use fitness as analogies in my content anyway. So I can see what is going viral with fitness in this space where it takes a lot of consistent showing up and putting in the work and slow progress over a long period of time to get the result of losing weight, which is very similar to creating content or building a business and the slow daily consistent work that you have to put in to make money. And I'm able to take some of those trends and move them over to my account and have those go viral and no one else in my space is using them. Now, there's a lot more that goes into growing a following on TikTok than just finding viral sound. So do me a favor, give me a follow and check out this video, which is my complete guide that will help you go from zero to 10,000 followers on TikTok. And you can use the same system to scale to over 50,000.